Yo, in this video, I'm going to show you guys the Husky liners. These are for my Ford F-150. These will uh, protect your carpet, your floorboard. And this is the classic style with a uh, distinct diamond tread. You can see in this video, I'll show you a one year post review and tell you guys how I like it. Underneath, uh, these are custom fit to your car. They're laser scanning technology. And they also have uh, carpet gripping nibs on the bottom and these will catch all the fluids and anything you can see in the corner right there all the dust and stuff it's been catching over the last month or two all the leaves and stuff it doesn't go too high so you get a little dirt up there and obviously uh, they have these little nubs to accommodate the nubs that are on your Ford F-150 floor so here I'm taking it out you can see all the dust and leaves and everything that it's caught works pretty well I haven't emptied these for probably three to four months so I'll show you later in the video uh, also how to wash them off how easy they dry. These Husky liners also carry a lifetime warranty against any cracking or breaking just uh, contact Husky liners and they'll uh, just send a proof of purchase and they'll send you a new one so here are knobs you can see underneath it's uh, still a little bit of dirt around the edges so it doesn't catch it all, but for the most part, it's pretty good. Here's the back. This is the one-piece back for the Ford F-150. I had to do a little bit of cutting just because of my uh, center council here, but it's uh, not. It's pretty easy. They have a pre kind of guide in the rubber that you make it cutting really easy. So you can see here, it goes all the way up to the edge, it cups around the edge. The only thing I wish it did was it cupped around the back, which it doesn't. So stuff does sometimes uh, fall down towards the back on the, in the middle. So here it is. You can see on behind the driver's seat, it's flat, so it doesn't really cup it. And that's because of the amplifier rack that I have, which I had a cut on the left hand right there. You can see it doesn't cup up. So these are little knobs for your uh, under your seats. On this side it cups, on the other side it doesn't. So basically, if you have speakers or the amplifier underneath, uh, so here's uh, what it didn't catch. It works pretty well, just along the back edge, of course, especially behind the driver's seat since I have the speaker there and I had to cut that piece out. Uh, I'll show you on this side, a little bit of dirt and stuff here, but overall, did a pretty good job. And now for the passenger seat. Let's see how well these are uh, molded to the frame. It looks pretty good. It's been there for a couple months. I'll see how much uh, dirt and dust it comes off. I might have to move the seat back a little bit to make uh, removing a little easier. Uh, a couple things here and there, but overall, did a good job. All right, you just make a double check after I remove the liner just to see what's left. So stuff does uh, end up creeping underneath and they're really easy to wash off as you can see. I just made uh, some rubber rubberized material, so pretty slick as long as you uh, don't let any gunk build up. 